I've been in the emergency department for over 30 years as a nurse um, in varied roles and uh, we're seeing people with COVID that are really sick. It's not a joke. I'm seeing now with the third wave, we intubated a 29 year old, a 32 year old, a 35 year old. Also people that are trying to stay away from the hospital and waiting too long when they have a problem, when they should be coming like heart attacks and people are just suddenly dying like in their 40s and 50s. It's been a, a real change in the age group of serious illness here. Uh, yesterday, actually, we broke a record for seeing over 200 patients, uh, which is not our normal, and um, it's really, really taken a strain on uh, working here in Emerge. And sometimes it's hard to go home when you uh, know that you've been face-to-face -face with positive COVID patient and things like that, and then you have to walk in your, your door, so you have to make sure that you shower and take all your clothes off, and still there's that little risk in the back of your mind. What if you're the reason that you've brought something home? to the safety of your little home that you've created. We have a newborn daughter, she's uh, a year and a half. So it's definitely kind of, you know, we, we go off of what public health and, and the experts are saying about how COVID doesn't really affect the young kids as much, but it's always the unknown and you never want to be the person who kind of brings something home from work uh, and infect your, your young year and a half year old daughter. Um, so it's definitely stressful. I mean, you know, you get calls from, from um, IPAC here saying they've had a potential exposure and it just puts a lot of stress um, on the family at home and, and um, definitely can't wait for this to be over. I guess I, I have a daughter now so I have no choice but to cope but it's been really overwhelming. Um, you feel very isolated and alone. Uh, even when people were meeting for outside like distance gatherings I felt like people didn't want me there when I started working again because they're worried about COVID and me giving them COVID even though I'm fully vaccinated. Um, yeah, you're just like pretty lonely. Like I'm grateful that I have my family, but that's all I have right now, so. I think generally we're all tired because of a, uh, uh, of third wave, but just trying to stay positive, uh, motivate uh, myself uh, to provide the same great service as we always uh, do and uh, trying to encourage myself and colleagues to stay positive, uh, work hard and uh, get through this together. I would like the community to know to please stay safe. Let's keep our emergency rooms empty. But if you do have a health condition, don't put it off till the last minute. We are still here to help anybody that's in need. And don't wait till last minute. But let's get this thing done and over with so we can all get back to our normal lives.